Eventually, Marvel Studios is going to want to make a couple more billion more than they ended up making with Avengers Endgame. Which probably means you introduce Avengers Secret Wars or just Marvel Secret Wars as a film, and you make all the money you could possibly imagine off of merchandise and box office. Now, the creator of Loki teases exactly that, and possible connections and teases that might be found throughout Loki. So when you look at the Marvel Studios approach to Loki and everything that's been said about how important it is, how messing with time is going to have ramifications going forward, not just with what happens in Avengers Endgame, but also how it ties into the TVA and how everything connects to one another, the fans are probably right to assume that this will somehow way further down the road affect something, possibly even tie it all the way into Secret Wars. So recently, Michael Waldron, the creator of Loki, got to sit down and do some interviews and make the press rounds and talk about various aspects of including the TVA, of of course time travel, the concepts of time travel, and how Marvel Studios has handled it compared to the comics. And when he was asked about the possibility of Loki setting up Secret Wars or having some effects on it in the future, this is what he said and I quote, We'll see. You probably know as well as I do. Not everything is just in there. If the purpose of that whole thing was just to introduce the audience and everything, yeah, we'll see how it plays out in the MCU moving forward, end quote. So again, he's not denying it, and I think it's one of those long-term plans where messing with multiverses in multiple projects, messing with time, space, continuities, the what-if content and everything, is all going to eventually converge up upon itself and give it 10-15 years from now when some characters have to be recast or the MCU has moved on for 25 years. They go, well, I guess now we got to take a step back and assess this situation. So let's do a Secret Wars. Let's literally blow it all apart. There's too much continuity. Then we take a few year break and then we reboot it all and we keep what works. Some of the younger actors, but we introduce a new Steve Rogers and things like that. And we bring back the old one and, you know, you play around with the concept just like Marvel Comics has. And it's quite evident that the multiverse, the TVA, Loki... Everything to do with Quantumania and Kang is all going to contribute to this in the long run. But the long run is going to be a while because this is something that's in the making for a long while. Like, there's probably things that are going to be paid off in Secret Wars that started in the first Avenger. Like, you know, this is a long-term plan. Kind of like Thanos was. And Thanos, by comparison, is a short-term plan compared to what Secret Wars will be.